for sure, but I'm sure he wants to do the best he can. And the two ball is not in, and for a total of three for Paul Lehman. And a surprise from Rockland, Mike Montgomery. Not sure how many threes he's taken during the year, but uh, maybe he's been saving them all. God, he's got it down to a science. He's got, I think he's got X's on the floor. He's putting them right on the X. No, he doesn't like that one. Move it all a little bit. There you go. And the two ball is up and around. Mike on a roll at the top of the key, and the two ball is good for six. Mike's got a chance. He's got the crowd going now. And this one can tie it. Take your time, Mike. No, off the front. So Mike comes up with eight. Real good run at it, but came up a little bit short, and he had plenty of time. Quick shooter. And he, and he tells Coach Elkinton, how come I couldn't shoot him in the game time? And here's the local favorite, Josh Nash. Six three is a freshman, Jim. When he fills out, he's going to be uh, quite a player. Josh gets one. And the two shot is good. Total of three on the first rack. If he can make the next, this ne next one is a good one. Is a seven, gives him seven. Nope, he's off at five. He's got to make most of this rack. Now he can't miss in order to tie, and I don't know. Oh, that's it. Josh can only get the best, most points possible. And the eight is no good for a six for Josh Nash. And now we have one shooter left from George's Valley. Sean Winchenbach, the only man with a chance to take the title away from Zach Conover. <laughs> and Sean starts off with one in the corner. And for two, he's at three, so he can't possibly beat Zach Conover. Again, time does not seem to be a problem for any of these boys. And a total of five for Sean Winston back. So we end up with the winner being Zach Conover comes over from Islesboro and is going to go home the three-point shooter champion. You notice it's getting warm in here, Jim, as the crowd is getting excited and the pace is certainly picked up. Well, they've been called to the sideline and very quickly, Jim, will go 